reading for the Pisces Pisces Sun Moon Horizon sign I want to say thank you for being here this is the month of September and we are going to be looking at your love reading you Pisces oh my god ah <sighs> Pisces it's hot it's hot Pisces all right Pisces let's look at your love readings thank you so much for reconnecting every month you Pisces I want to say I am loving you guys so much I'm gonna be surprising you guys um I have surprises coming up because I'm sharing something with you guys but anyway, let's check out and see what's happening for the Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising Sun. We're calling up on Venus, the goddess of love, to come in and show us the Pisces. I know you're here, baby girl, but we still need you in. Wow, it's just like I'm I'm with the Pisces, and it's like I'm just <laughs> Okay, Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising sign, month of September. Please show us the energy. What is going to be the general energies for the Pisces? Ooh. Yes, Pisces. Mm, mm, mm. This is about some of you Pisces wants to get um, engaged. Some of you Pisces wants to get engaged you know that this is the person for you you want to spend the rest of your life with this person engage man bam 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 <laughs> okay Pisces okay there is definitely engagement coming up whenever true gem is coming up is that you find that this person is the love of your life and you definitely wants to um, engage to this person um this is wonderful because I love the energy of true gem it is just the card of engagement It's the card of you are the one and I want to spend the rest of my life with you so when true gem comes up some of you are, are really seeing the real um, wonderful characteristic of someone in your life you know and um, what is transpiring is that uh, the universe um, is opening up your sh your art chakra okay some of you a new person could be entering your life okay and uh, some of you a new face to your relationship is going to be beginning and some of you are going to be moving from out of friendship to relationship and from relationship to getting married engaged and getting married happiness and joy is going to be here is a renewal for love for a lot of you Pisces a lot of you Pisces are in a relationship a renewal of love okay so this is a wonderful month for you Pisces a true gem is here okay so let's move along and see what's coming up in the communication section for the Pisces um, you are communicated and that is what I'm saying a lot of you Pisces want to get married or your communication is about family okay so it could be that you have a family you're communicating with your your family your kids your wife but you're showing love okay it's all about communication it's all about uh, letting your partner knows what you want um, some of you could be you know saying it's time that we start having kids but communication is about kids and family some of you who are dealing with a red ear or a blonde person this this is going to be over because they're in the strength they're in the, the the position of strength and they're coming up in the reverse form meaning that they're not fully um, want to be in this relationship um, some of you this could be if you're a Pisces it's as if you are saying and you're holding off that sort of an energy because you're thinking I don't know if I really want to be in weakness I'm seeing the energy of the blondes um, blue eyes um, Caucasian men um, you have weakness to someone but this person is brushing you off so you could um, like a blonde female you Caucasian but this person is brushing you off in reality reality your soulmate some of you are in a soulmate 
um, relationship. Some of you could be thinking that this person is your soulmate, but this person is brushing you off. It's as if they don't. It's a short term relationship. It's something short term. It's as if uh, you were in something short term with someone and you're thinking that this person is your soulmate. But there's a lot of gossip around you, especially you men. You men could think that you are in a relationship with a blonde woman, but this woman is blowing you off. They don't want to be with you. This woman is thinking it was just short term. Leave me alone. I don't want to be in this. Okay. I don't want to have a relationship with you. It's as if this person just took you for a ride and you are still holding on to this person and this person is like, let me go. And you're thinking this is your soulmate, but there's a lot of gossip that is going on because people know that you were in a relationship and uh, um, people know your shit and um, it's as if you want to end your relationship and go with this person and this person doesn't want you okay I'm seeing um, people or um, who had divorced their family they're returning like um, you divorce your wife and uh, you know you left the, the house the family house I'm seeing that um, they're returning um, you young men you're in a short-term relationship these are a lot of short-term relationship and the universe is saying give your soulmate a relationship is just lesson to be learned I'm seeing the short-term relationship is because of financial situation why this person I'm seeing a lot of attract attraction and it is a relationship from a past life okay so whatever is transpiring here I'm seeing a lot of you trying to express yourself to this person you're trying to express yourself to this person and expressing love to this person but this person is not interested in you and we're talking about the Caucasian the blondes and blue eyes um, you're in love with someone that is not in love with you it's a waste of time this person um, you're you know um, you know they were attracted to you or deceptiveness comes out so you young men are very deceptive okay you young men are very deceptive I'm seeing deceptiveness came out where the seven of swords you're trying to get away with something but the universe um, the universe is going to on heartbreaks for the soulmate heartbreaks for the soulmate so um, okay so your soulmate is going to be heartbroken because I'm seeing that you want to move away with someone um, younger, but this person doesn't want you. And I am seeing your soulmate letting you go, but you will never return because this person is not going to be open up their energy for you to return because they know that you were deceptive. Okay, so um yeah and whatever is transpiring i'm seeing um for you men whatever is transpiring and whatever is happening is that this person is not really at you are attracted to, to this person and you're in the relationship with this person and the person who you're in a relationship with is your soulmate and this person um could be heartbroken and is going to be heartbroken because they realize that you have deceived them and I think they're not going to be heartbroken because of love the relationship that you're in love but they're going to be heartbroken that you have deceived them you know deceive them their happiness for such a long time and they and 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 this is what is transpiring okay you have deceived them their happiness for such a long time and I think that that is what they're going to be heartbroken over not being heartbroken over that you are leaving them for someone else but they are heartbroken because you have lied and deceived them and you know it's as if you're gonna be starting this relationship with this new person and in a couple months time not six months but before six months this relationship is going to be over because the universe see that you have not been and you know this is it um, there is some lies and deceptiveness 
and especially and this is only for the Caucasian okay this is only for the Caucasian because it fell out on the Caucasian so this is only for the Caucasian men and these men are between the a the, the energy of um, these Caucasian men is between the ages of uh, hmm, maybe to 35 between 35 and 40 55 you're not very honest and your soulmate because you're in a relationship with a soulmate some of you are in a relationship with a soulmate is like you are the weakness um, this month in love you are the weakness because you're not being honest and it's as if the month of September is showing up your dishonesty to yourself but also to other people so you have been playing a game and whatever this game is and whatever that has been transpiring you have been playing a game and it's going to come out there is a younger person like you're leaving your soulmate to go to a younger person but they don't want you they they don't want you um, it is a past life love They're you are attracted to them but they're not attracted to you so whatever is transpiring here and whatever is happening you know your soulmate this person that you have been in a relationship for a long time they're going to just be upset because you deceived them a second time but not upset with you because of what you have done it's just they're going to be upset because you deceived them another time and I hope it's not an earth sign person because you're going to fall on your face okay because there is just something about water and hurt especially in this sort of a deceptive situation that you always end up falling on your face okay whoever you're going after don't really want you because um, they're much younger they're not looking for someone in this collaborative of relationship and I think your soulmate is just going to be pissed off that you have been lying to them so long you know that is what is going to happen is that they're going to be just pissed off that you deceive them a second time but you'll never ever they will never ever give you a chance in this lifetime and in another lifetime okay alrighty okay new love is coming in for some people new love is coming in so if you're a singles I'm seeing you're going to be meeting someone new so if you are a single, I'm seeing you're going to be meeting someone new. Okay, so um, singles are going to be meeting someone new. I'm seeing um, the Burnets. You're not really interested in whatever is going on. It's like you're just enjoying yourself, learning to love yourself. New love is definitely going to be coming in. It was destined to be. Some of you are going to be meeting someone unexpectedly. And this is going to be good because you're going to be meeting someone unexpectedly and this is going to be good so whatever is going on and whatever that is transpiring um, yeah um, it's good it's good not to worry about it it's good not to worry about it this is good because um, for the singles this is going to be good because things are going to be working out okay so for the singles this is going to be good things are going to be working out and you are going to be okay so whatever is happening singles this is going to be good let's look in couples relationship because for you Caucasian you know I'm not all of you short-term relationship true gem and marriage is in the reverse okay so we all know what's happening with um, so some of you are in relationship short-term relationship and it has to do with the blonde here I told you so whoever out there is cheating you're in a short-term relationship and uh, if you are deciding the person the other person doesn't want you it is going to be short-lived so I'm seeing you ending your relationship breaking up with someone and the person is not going to continue with you it's a short-term relationship and it's this person big so whatever it is and whatever that is transpired um, yeah so there is some controlling issues some of you in marriage you're having controlling issues in your marriage 
um, there are controlling issues in your marriage so this is something that is affecting the people in marriage that there is controlling issues okay um blonde 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 so hmm. so these two these two it's a short-term relationship and this person think that they're a true gem um let's see what is going to be happening <laughs> and you know something you know let it be whoever you are let it be karma i, I just see everything is coming up in reverse for you pisces what the hell is going on um okay so this is past life love your whoever is married is having past life love i'm seeing a lot of communication between these two but it's a karmatic situation and it's going to be short-lived um whoever you are um it's um they're going to find out your soulmate is going to find out she's going to end yes I knew it was a Capricorn but that is going to be ended yeah I, I knew it was a Capricorn okay so some of you are in a relationship uh, with a young um, uh, earth sign person and um, it's karmatic it's a karmatic relationship it's going to be short-lived it's a karmatic relationship it's going to be short-lived okay then we see um, you ladies who came up um, and you're in relationship you have been in a long-term relationship you have been texting with someone else this is going to come to an end and your relationship is going to come to an end and you there's no one that is going to be connecting with you okay because um, you try to get involved in another relationship and for the people who are married I'm seeing yes um you need you know it's like the relationship is controlling you're in a marriage it is controlling you need to release yourself from this relationship this marriage is a past life issue yes it is controlling the, uh, you know whatever you're thinking about your marriage or relationship yes it is controlling whatever that is transpiring for you Pisces yes it's controlling and this is the reason why now whatever is transpiring and whatever is happening I am seeing that um, whatever is here and you're in um, you're in a relationship some of you are in a soulmate relationship because of what the other person have it's not because you love this person and you want to be with this person it's because of what the other person have and you're going for someone else but this is only short term because this person is going to let you fall on your face so um, yeah whatever is happening this doesn't look good but I can tell you you guys one thing if it's um, earth sign people they are going to like let you fall and let you fall very hard so um, fall in fall on your face or fall fall in love but you're going through a karmatic situation there's a lot of texts and a lot of situation that is going back and front okay so it's hot Enjoy your month. Namaste.